let's start okay go to architecture reference plane draw a reference plane horizontal and one vertical okay put dimension okay pick horizontal change the dimension to four meters <coughs> put dimension okay select make it two meters okay then select reference plane mirror select the other one mirror okay now let's go to <coughs> massing inside in place mask mask one okay select rectangle pick at the lower corner to the next corner okay create form now let's go to south elevation okay let's adjust the height pull down uh, let's change it to 0.2 meters okay let's go to 3d okay select the surface the top surface select <coughs> select oh, it's hard to select okay select then divide surface then you grid change the number to 2 okay B grid change the number to 1 okay then select again uh, select the rectangular pattern select the component the rectangle space frame 7 okay okay let's check check the joint diameter let's make it bigger 0.4 okay okay next um, finish mass okay let's go to um, level 2 Let's check level one. Okay. Uh, let's go to level two. Uh, architecture, create floor. Then select concrete slab, 400 mm thick. Select rectangle. Let's make an offset of 0.5 meters. Select the lower corner. Then go to the upper corner. Okay. Finish. Okay. Let's look the perspective. Okay. Let's go to level 2 create a wall select storefront two-way uh, with spider fitting uh, two-way spider circular for post storefront select okay rectangle ok 
Okay. Top of beam. Level 3. Then, select an offset of point, point 0.4. <coughs> select the lower corner. Space. So, okay. Then, select the top corner. Okay. Finish the command. Cancel. Let's see. Okay. Finish. Now, now let's look the perspective. Okay. Okay. Let's now let's go to level one. Okay. Then oh, let's go to level two. Now let's create a wall. Select a uh, point the wall 500 uh, edit type uh, edit uh, it's a 0.5 meter thick wall okay uh, make it a uh, interior finish face interior let's make an offset of 1.5 pick the lower corner then the top corner okay let's look the perspective select the wall change the base offset base constraint to first floor okay now let's go to level one let's create a uh, Stair. Select a wood ledge. Okay. Stair. Okay. Pick. Then pick. So the actual run width is 1.5. Huh? Okay. Finish. Let's see. Select the railings. Delete. Select the other one tab. Okay. Delete. Okay, now let's go to level 2, uh, select repellent plane here, then make a copy, copy of 2 meters, okay, select the slab, edit boundary, align the slab, select the reference plane, then, okay, finish. go to level 3 ok let's create a floor select a floor so 400 mm concrete slab floor select rectangle select from lower corner to the upper corner align with the walls ok would you like walls that go up to this floor's level to attach to its bottom? Yes. Okay. Just delete the elements. Okay. Now let's look at the perspective. Okay. Let's go to level 2. Let's create a wall. Select wall 500. Okay. Select exterior. Okay. Cancel. Select at the top corner. Then. Okay. Finish the wall. Let's look at the perspective. Okay, now you have hide the uh, hide in view elements. Okay, now you have a finished exterior. 
model. Thank you.